you ever sat at the vice, vanishing, then vanishing, then vanishing, or putting an epoxy on the fly, waiting for it to dry, putting some more? Well, things are starting to change. There's a tub, there's a torch. How do we use them? How is it gonna help us? Watch this. First of all, we need a fly to use the stuff on. So I'm gonna tie a very, very simple coronamid, or buzzer. So just get a nice body of black silk all the way down. Then we're just gonna use a fine gold wire as a rib. I'm just gonna fold that around just to tie it in. And just take your time when you're coming back up, touching turns all the way. So you get an even body all the way up. And then we're gonna rib it, open turns as even as possible. Up into there, lock it in place. Get rid of the wire for the cheeks, orange cheeks, use some floss, sometimes use crisp packet as well. So we're gonna have double thickness of floss. Let's just bring that silk back down a little bit. Double thickness of floss on this side. Let's tie that in place back there. Same on the other side. tie it in place and then we're going to build up the bubble in the head just with the silk keep it going nice rugby ball shape and then just pull the floss silk up to the nearly to the front of the eye Pull the floss on this side. Same on that side. Locking in place on the side. All right, a couple more turns. Sharp scissors. Cut it close. Cut that close. So we've got the hotspot nymph. Or buzzer, just tidy that head up. Just get rid of those end bits. We're finished. Right, that's the fly. Now it would mean Sally Hansen hard as nails. One coat, put it in a clip leave it on the bench, dry for 15, 20 minutes. Another coat, another coat, and another coat. What a waste of time. This one, absolutely brilliant. But because I've got the vise at this angle, when I rotate the vise, you'll see the fly doesn't go flat. So what I'm gonna do, we're gonna push the vise down straight, put the fly in there. So when I rotate, it goes flatter. Now then, bug bond. Great thing is you can put as much or as little as possible on and nothing whatsoever will happen until you hit it with a UV light. So if you put too much on, simply scrape it off. And you can just take your time, just building up, building up. And it's got this really fine nozzle so you can get it going exactly where you want Get that nice shape. Now there's a little bit too much on the top, so I'll just scrape that off. Scrape it off the nozzle. There we go, get the shape. Make sure I covered all the thread in the head. Right, there we go. A little bit more there. All right, that'll just stay in place. Just keep rotating it. To cure it, UV. Now, just shine it. And as you can see, when I put that UV light, that orange 
floss just really shines out and will be a trigger point for the fish. On black silk, they say just leave it a little bit longer than on olive or brown or red silk. It just takes a little bit longer to cure. And hey, there you go. So get yourself a tub of bug bond, UV torch. It'll save you hours and hours of time at the vice.